Hello everybody, welcome back to another Adobe Illustrator tutorial. In this one, I'm gonna show you how to type text along a path or along a shape or a line or all those different things you can imagine. As you can see here, I've got a few examples. Let's start from scratch. I'm gonna show you very, very quickly how to do it. So I'm just gonna create a custom 1500 by 1500 and let's go. The first thing I'm gonna show you how to do is type text along a shape. Let's go ahead and use an ellipse. So we're just gonna create a nice little cool circle. And there's our circle. Now, how do I get type to go along the circle? All you gotta do is go over to the type tool, drop it down, and then select type on a path tool right here. When you do that, zoom in, and when you get close, you're gonna see these little squiggly lines right there on the left and the right side. It tends to hover in and out, but just click on, oops, there we go. Click on it right there, and presto, we've got some text. It automatically applies Latin text, so the old, uh, non sequitur etc etc lorem ipsum some dolor crap um but there it is and then if you want to change the uh, font of course you can just go right in here and do that let me show you one other thing i just go ahead and i'm actually going to make this a little bit bigger so i'm going to increase the the size so there we go we got a nice and big so you can see it okay good so there you go that's how you do that now if you don't like where it begins and this is an important part if the text is beginning on the right side of the circle and you want it to begin at the top but when i zoom in i've gone ahead grab the Direct selection tool, and you'll see these lines here. And if I start pulling on lines like this, you're gonna see that I can start pulling text backwards and forwards. And again, this is kind of a little weird because I went about it sideways, but again, now you can see that I have moved the beginning to where I kind of want it. So I want it up here at the top, presto, right there. You see the purple line go through it. Now the text begins at the top. And if I wanted to change it, I would just double click on it and write Curtis. Okay, so that's how you do that. Type along a path or a shape and at the same time change the position of it. Let me just show you a little bit one more other thing here. You can create your own paths if you wanna grab the pen tool for example. I'm just gonna create something funky like this and then I'm gonna do this and then maybe not that far. Something like that and then something like that, okay? Now, the first thing you're gonna notice is it doesn't look right and that's true because I've got the fill set and no stroke. So I'm gonna take the fill off I'm going to click this button here, and now I've just got a path. If I want to type along that path, I'm just going to switch my tools to the direct selection tool. I'm going to hover over it, and then watch. I'm just going to grab that same tool right here, type on a path tool. I'm going to type right here, click on that, and wherever I click is where the text begins. This is how you do it, and I'm going to go Pike Curtis, something like that. It doesn't matter what it says. This is how you type and adjust text along a path and along shapes in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks for watching.